Oh, my voice is completely gone, but I'm going to be talking about college, and hopefully you can understand me. I'm going to make myself as clear as possible, but we're going to work on that. So what I really want to talk about college is now that I'm in it, the way I'm dealing with college is a little bit different than how some people may deal with college. Um, the way I went is very untraditional. I mean, I'm going to a four-year university, but I want to talk about my differences a little bit later. Um, but basically, I'm talking about college because I watch college videos and I can relate to some of the stuff, but I couldn't relate to everything. So I made something about me. So let's get into it. So, if you can't tell, I'm in my own apartment. Um, my college, or I guess my university, it has housing, but not for students like me because I'm a traditional residential student. That means I go to classes on campus. So, I'm not international and I'm not an athlete. So, that means I don't qualify for housing just yet. Um, basically, about my school, it was a community college and it turned into a university so that's the reason why they don't have housing just quite yet but i know that they will for me they said next year but their apartments i'm not sure how it works i don't know if it's like roommates or anything all i know is that it's an apartment complex for international students um most of international students are chinese i heard some korean in there at an orientation. Now, like I said, the college I chose is a four-year university. Small, only a thousand students for the whole entire campus. So that means that it is very intimate. It's nice. I'm more involved. If I wanted to start a club, it'd be easier. I mean, more or less because more because I could be captain I can be in charge you know, that makes me sound power hungry but then it's not that many people so that means that it's gonna be harder to get the numbers but that's okay and also it doesn't have sorority which I'm like eh. there's no rushing for me but hopefully I can start that up too I mean there is like some sororities but it's like like the honor academy club sorority and stuff like that and if you're into psychology major I don't it's just not a regular like aka or Delta Sigma Theta I know there's other sororities out there that are not black based but hey I don't know them I chose Bellevue University um, home of the Bruins in Omaha, Nebraska, and I'm not originally from Nebraska, I'm actually from the East Coast, but I moved here, the reason why, rent was cheap, $5.95, also classes are cheap, $2.75 for credit hour, which means I can afford it, and Threads, I liked that it was easier to get into, and they don't require, like, an essay or teacher recommendations, so when it was senior year and a lot of my friends were doing what they do when it comes to college, I was sitting in the sun somewhere, so it was easy. For my plans for college since I'm a freshman and I start on Monday is that I want to be involved. I did all the theater program here. And I love theater. I wish I could do musical theater, which I'm so used to, but oh, that would take a whole lot of work. And I'm writing a play myself, but I don't want to be like Tyler Perry, producing, writing, and acting. So I'll just produce and direct and maybe write. Like I said, my experience is different because I live in an apartment. Oh, also, I take night classes because I'm working full time during the day. And that would have been really hard if I went to a traditional university. So, yeah, I go to school from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. Also, my school does not have semesters. Um, they have, okay, so 
So they have quarter. It depends. There's quarters if you want it to be quarters. They have semesters if you want it to be semesters. And they also have trimesters if you want it to be trimesters. Want it to be trimesters. I decided to do the traditional trimester route because trimesters act like semesters. I go from the fall quarter is from August 31st to November. And then after November is December, blah, 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 to spring, and spring to summer. And that, and that is for them is regular full-time student. And like I said, there's not a lot of sororities. There's not a lot of clubs or organizations. Um, there's soccer. I like soccer. I like to play. Um, there's golfing, volleyball, basketball, culture club honor societies and stuff and my university is still growing so that's what I like about it it's still growing so yeah that's in this video um, I just want to put my experience out there because it's mixed between traditional and non-traditional blah, blah 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 so it's been a good chat